Things look like business as usual inside courtroom 4D at Franklin County Municipal Court, but the building is filled with reminders of just how different things are. It's um, actually kind of blowing my mind. Certain functions, such as hearing cases involving county jail prisoners, remain essential at the court. Many other services have been postponed. Among those are programs with some of the most vulnerable people in the criminal justice system drug court participants. People are in these specialized dockets. They do rely a lot on the courts to give them that support. And one of the things that we focus so much in heart is that support system outside of the courthouse. It's a communal foundation for Judge Jody Thomas's heart program, which stands for helping achieve recovery together. Since members can't come to the court for their weekly meetings, Judge Thomas and her staff are keeping tabs. We had a girl celebrating her two years today. I talked to her earlier today. And even though I talked to her two days ago, just to get that phone call to say that I'm recognizing an important day for her, it does go a long way. One outlet for those in the docket is a group Facebook page, where a peer recovery supporter provides links to services and encouragement. In the meantime, Judge Thomas and her staff are tinkering with technology to resume regular group sessions. Since we have over 100 and some participants, that takes a little bit of um, organizing because we want to make sure that when they do participate in the Zoom meeting, that they feel that they can be heard and engaged. As challenging as it's been for everyone involved over the past few weeks, the drug court team has used the opportunity for ingenuity. New methods now could lead to more efficient and successful practices in the future. It's also an approach that's pivotal for people dealing with substance use issues. We're hoping that the things that we're doing now, that we're providing them tools and support that when, when bad things happen, they can handle them and stay in recovery and be clean and do all the amazing things that we know that they have the potential to do. I'm Chaba Sukost for Court News Ohio.